Hello guys, welcome back to Code with Maddie. And in this video, we will solve Blue Flame uh, Labs coding question, which was asked uh, on uh, 21st of de December, that is yesterday. Uh, the coding question was asked on prime numbers. Uh, we have to uh, count the prime numbers within a given range. For example, I have to count the uh, prime numbers from 1 to 10, then the prime numbers are between 1 to 10 are 2, 3 and uh, 5 and 7 then uh, the number of counts are uh, 4 then it, it should have written 4 uh, count as a number of primes ok uh, let's start to code ok I will take A as input it will be the higher uh, limit for the loop or we will say uh, one more keyword I will use that uh, sorry not keyword it, uh, variable to count the number of prime numbers after that we will use for loop whether we have to check that we have to run this for loop from 1 to 1 to a plus 1 if I use here a the last number will not be counted like uh, if I enter 10 10 the for loop will <coughs> run up to if I enter here uh, only A, the for loop will uh, run up to 9 only. For that, uh, I have to here use uh, A plus 1 to run till 10. Okay. After that, <coughs> we'll check that uh, if I is equal to equal to 1, then we have to just continue. We have to skip that 1 and flag equal to. Uh, we have to use one more uh, variable that is uh, flag uh, we'll check that if flag is 1 then we have to uh, increment the uh, this increment the counter if flag is 0 it should not increment the counter value ok we'll set here flag equal to 1 then we'll use another for loop and this for loop will run from 2 to till i by i divided by 2 plus 1 ok we'll check one more condition that is i mod uh, j is equal to equal to 0 if it is equal to equal to 0 it should flag as flag is 0 ok the flag value should change to 0 uh, if flag is 0 then it has to break ok if suppose my uh, uh, number is 4 uh, my number is 4 if, uh, if this condition comes true that uh, 4, uh, 4 is not prime number then if it comes true then it will uh, break this loop the whole loop when it will come out of the loop it will check that if uh, flag is if flag is uh, equal to equal to 1 or 0 if it is 0 it will uh, it, it, if it is 1 it will go to the uh, loop uh, not loop uh, condition it will increment the counter value the this flag when it comes to true then only it will increment the value if it is zero it will not increment the value then at the last we have to just uh, print the counter value ok we will run and check the output if i enter here 10 it should print as a 4 if i enter at uh, 15 it should give uh, output as a 6 if I enter uh, 20 it should give as a 8 uh, if I enter 100 uh, we will check how many numbers are there I think uh, there are 25 oh that's the uh, right answer and this was the easiest question uh, thank you for watching